Yep. The Supreme Court is due to make a decision whether or not it's legal for the administration to end the DACA program. The Brazos Interfaith Immigration Network is reminding anyone with a DACA status that expires in 2020 to file for early renewal as soon as possible. There are a lot of changes in immigration law that have been happening and a lot of proposed changes that may happen. And so there's a lot of confusion. Not much is known as to when exactly the Supreme Court decision will come involving the legality for the Trump administration to end the DACA program. Most estimates I've seen put it somewhere between this upcoming March, so next month and July. As the uncertainty of DACA remains in the air, immigration law firms in Texas are doing their best to help those who rely on the policy. You can actually renew your DACA status at any time in the process, and it's valid for two years. So if you file it now, even if the Supreme Court comes down and decides against those who have DACA, they would be able to continue with their status and their work permit uh, for two years. At Brazos Interfaith Immigration Network workshops, attorneys are answering questions. A few questions about the possibility of the price to renew DACA going up. And setting the record straight on issues involving DACA. That is something that has been uh, put forward by the Trump administration. Ben says these workshops are as important as ever to help get information out to those who may be affected. We think it's really important that people get accurate information in a timely way, so we're very grateful when people gen generously donate their time to come answer questions. Attorneys say they are glad to help where it is needed. Uh, honestly, I think education and information is 100% crucial for immigration. Ben is hosting a sip and learn at 3 p.m. on Sunday at their office in Bryan. A local immigration attorney will be there to talk about the challenges of being an immigrant in the Brazos Valley.